I put those guns down now if I were you. Let's stand out. All right, man, we're good, we're good. Go, back it up! An 80s action classic gets a high-tech makeover in RoboCop. This time around, the violence is less gory than in the original, but it's still pretty intense. Add in some strong language and sexual situations, and you've got a sci-fi thriller that's better left for older teens. Set in the year 2028, RoboCop tells the story of Alex Murphy, a loving husband, father, and honest cop fighting crime on the streets of Detroit. Officer down. When he's critically injured in the line of duty, scientists rebuild Murphy into a part man, part robot police officer. Gonna play good cop, bad cop. This movie is filled with guns, nonstop shooting, and dead bodies, but surprisingly little blood. Viewers also see gruesome photos of the main character after an accident, as well as some creepy operation footage. You say you can save him. What does that mean? Mixed in with the mayhem are a few kissing scenes and several drug references. This, my friends, is the future of American justice. While this entertaining remake doesn't quite live up to the original, it still poses some interesting questions about humanity and freedom. Common Sense Media gives RoboCop three out of five stars and says it's a niffy choice for teens age 14 and under. For more reviews and age-appropriate media picks, check out our mobile app or visit us at commonsense.org. I'm Lori Burke.